let's take a look at uh, a couple of different things uh, here. There's a little confusion sometimes on the difference between poison ivy and Virginia creeper. They're real common vines in these parts of the state, all over the United States for that matter. And here's a couple of examples right down here. Um, this poison ivy. A lot of people are, are highly allergic to this and they get it on their hands that can really cause some severe rashes. And, and the way to know that poison ivy is it's got these three leaves. Um, <clears throat> there's an old saying, I can't remember what it is, but, but this is Virginia creeper. <clears throat> this has five leaves. I'm going to just rip this up right here. It's different. And uh, sometimes you'll find a plant like Virginia creeper that just has three leaves. It's probably a, a real immature young plant, but it will uh, mostly develop five leaves, almost always. And that's the way to tell the difference. You don't have to worry about this. You can get it all over your hands, and it's not going to bother you. Um, so... Uh, you see a plant like this in these red petioles right here. You can see the, the red petioles. That's another indication. Uh, petiole is the little short part of the stem before the leaf starts. Uh, is another sign that you're looking at poison ivy. But just uh, beware of that and, and don't worry about Virginia creeper. Virginia creeper is not a plant that's going to um, cause you any, any problems. So this time of the year, it's... Uh, not a great time of the year to find a lot of things in bloom. I thought I might find some oak leaf hydrangea and, and show you some of that native uh, oak leaf hydrangea out here. And there's other things, but it's it's a uh, it's a hot, dry time of the year, and there's not a whole lot. So um, one thing that I can talk to you about, though, is the legend of some Aborigine uh, Shelby County, Chilton County woods people. It's a it's kind of a far-fetched tale of uh, woodsmen that live in this area, uh, they survive on uh, rodents and berries. Uh, they say that they're friendly, but there's also some talk that they have uh, an aggressive nature about them, and I'm really not sure that, uh, uh, I don't think they've ever been spotted, uh, at least not on film, not documented which may, leaves me a little bit leery about the whole supposition that these people actually exist. Um, I'm inclined not to believe it, but I believe that, uh, you know, somewhere in this world there is this kind of creature, uh, but just not around here. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the demonstration on poison ivy and uh, Virginia Creeper.